everyone, I'm Chantelle and welcome back to my channel and if you are new here then welcome, thank you so much for joining me, I hope you're all having an amazing day. So in today's video I thought I'd do a review on the new MUA bronzer and the new MUA blush, so without further ado let's get into the video. So here we are, just get it out, <laughs> now I'm dropping things, when am I not dropping things? Anyway. I've got two MUA bl um, bronzers and an MUA blush. The shades of the bronzers are Solo Hashtag 120 and Solo Hashtag 130. Um, I didn't know which shade I was, um, so I just bought them both. They was on three for two, so I just got one of them free anyway. And then the blusher, oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that little rose, how pretty is that? And this is in Rouge Punch and it is a matte blush powder and I absolutely love matte blushes. So I'm going to swatch both of these for you and I'm going to see which one suits my skin tone better. So I'm going to swatch the lighter one first, which is 120. So this is what, oh my gosh, they're so pretty. So I'm going to swap the just like the other ones, creamy. It's not as pigmented as the one pound one, but it's still pigmented. So I'm going to do another swatch. There we go. So that is the hashtag 120 and now I'm going to swatch the hashtag 130. Because of the um, ridges, it feels really weird. <laughs> oh, that one's pretty. I like quite a deep blush. But I didn't know if one of them was going to come out more ready, which... Hmm, that one has got more of a ready undertone. But I do like that one better. So I think I'm going to go in with the hashtag 130. So I'm going to go in with the hashtag 130 because I think that one will match me better. Plus I like a, a nice deep bronzer anyway. Ooh, pigmented. Wow. Now that is quite red on the skin. Oh, it might be just a tad bit too dark. I'm going to go in with this one on the other side. Oh. Need to blend. Blend, blend, blend. You definitely don't need a heavy hand with this bronzer. The all these bronzers retail for two pound. Is it two pound each? No, nope, two pound fifty each. Wow. But I just can't fault any way bronzers at all. I just love all the bronzers. So I'm going to go in with the hashtag 120 on the same brush. They're just so pigmented. I'm liking this one a lot better than this, so my judgement was wrong. But they're easy to blend, but make sure you go in with a soft hand. Because otherwise you'll get like a... Um, it like this. <laughs> So this is 120, this one, because I went in so heavy, 
it's come out really like intense so i'm just gonna no we go uh, but i am loving this side a, a lot lot better oh i really really like them both i can work with this because obviously i went in with a heavy hand like i said about a thousand times um but i think i, I prefer the 120 more for my skin tone and i probably could contour with this shade yeah i do like them though i've I had high expectations for them anyway. So now I'm going to move on to the MUA blush in the shade Rouge Punch. Just got to open it. There we go. I'm just going to get a brush. So I'm going to... Oh, just look at that. I, I don't want to wreck it. <laughs> so I'm going to swatch this now for you. That is so smooth and creamy. It's coming off more pink than I expected. I thought it was going to be more of um, a dusty, pinky colour. And you can see where it's a bit powdery, but once you rub it in, that goes. So let's see how it is on the skin. There's a lot of fallout with this, as you can see. <coughs> oh, get. Oh. That's pigmented too. Light hand, Shanta. Light hand. I'm just like, ho, 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 get it on there. I need to be a bit more lighter with it. With everything, really. Oh, I really like it. It's quite. It's coming off really, really pink in cam in the camera, but it's not actually that pink. I think it's just the lighting. But I'm just going to take my beauty blender, go over the top of it. Oh, I really like that. It looks really, really pink in camera. It's annoying me. Because it's not that pink in real life. I am absolutely loving this side more than this. I just feel like it's really, really gone really dark around here. But just going to ignore it. Ignore it. So this is a close-up. There we go. Uh, I'm now going to apply my highlighter. Um, I'm just going to spray my face with some priming water. Just so all the powders come together. I think it really does help. Ooh. What highlighter should we take today? Hmm, I'm stuck for choice. I'm going to take my Ofra Feeling Myself Highlighter Palette. Now, this palette has three shades in. Uh, the three shades we have built blissful pillow talk and rodeo drive and i am going to make mix <laughs> blissful and rodeo drive together absolutely love all for highlights i just think they're absolutely amazing well worth the money if you like a proper boom out the highlighter in your face definitely go and purchase a ultra highlight i'm not too sure if they sell this anymore but i do have the glow goals ultra highlight and i've hit pan on that really bad um it's my favorite highlight of all time um yeah i absolutely love them Get popping.
There we go. So I'm now just going to set my face with some um, Kate All Nighter Spray. So this is the finished look, guys. They are definitely, definitely worth the money. So these are retail at £2.50 each. So go grab them while you can. Uh, yeah, I absolutely love them. So if you did enjoy the video, please smash that big thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe if you've not already. It would really mean a lot to me. Um, and I hope to see you all next time. Bye.